Carvin is up for this main event, ladies and gentlemen. And I hope so are you. Carl McCulloch taking on John Michael Shields. They've trained together, they've shared the gym. Carl is a traditional K1 Muay Thai fighter. JMS is an MMA fighter who wants to test himself in the K1 realms against some of the best in Ireland. And he's got that in Carl McCulloch. A marauder, a front runner. Pressure for days, but susceptible to counters. I think he's doing exactly what he should be doing. He should be attacking the leg, doing the stuff he's good at. Low kick. Don't feel us not getting any success on that. JMS is going to be dangerous with his movement. And although and maybe not a Muay Thai, he is a wily veteran at JMS. Yes, and that's, that's he's unpredictable, and that's very much his strength in this match. The problem is you're going to see a few more of them kicks. That could be the match in A-class. You can't take too many of them. Look at the nice size. Nice right of hand there, though, by JMS, and again! That was two in a row, JMS. Shown his power, John Michael Shields. He's going back for that kick, setting it up. McCallick should be going straight to that leg. Yeah, it's, it's JMS, you, you probably want to lull Carl into a, 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 a boxing fight here. Absolutely, feed the jab, set it up, go to the leg for a little bit, and then go back to the head. You also seen Carl come back with the overhand, which means his ego was damaged a little bit. He wanted to get that same shot back. He needs to focus on his own game, chop the legs. Look at the size of them legs, they're like tree trunks. Yeah, tree trunks. You can see the lacerations on JMS's leg already. Yeah, I hope we have an ice pack ready. We can hear that noise, it's like a, a wet fish hitting a table. Where's that knee? That's it, turning knee. Looking for that elbow. He's doing it in the right distance, in that close range. He needs to be a little bit more snappier and a little, little bit more sneaky. Just needs to be careful, that jab is a little slow, and JMS will try and counter that. We can see now, big guys like this, this is hovering around my weight division a few years ago, 78 to 84. Unless they conserve their energy and use it smartly, they're gonna get tired very fast. There's a lot of muscle going on in there in the ring. That needs a lot of oxygen. That fast pace start from Karma Kalik could come back to haunt them, I think, is what you're potentially alluding to, Mark. I've been there. I've been there in the early days, using too much energy too soon and paid the price. Vastly but different sport, but John Michael Shields has just come back from a successful grappling competition. So he has been competing. Well, Carlos switched to MMA and was training predominantly MMA for a long period, a couple of fights in MMA, so. Like these guys have been around a long time. You know, it's, it's, it's a credit to the sport that you can jump in and out. Yeah. Between K1, MMA, traveling abroad, grappling. Blood is trickling out of the nose of Carl McCallick, but it's not a Carl McCallick fight unless there is blood coming from that nose. <laughs> There's nice that right hand again! Just needs to keep them hands nice up. Nice tape as well, and John Michael Shields showed beautiful technique in here. 10 seconds, both breathing hard. JMS looking the more confident. Yeah, he's throwing the straighter shots here and having success. Nice flying knee. Great round. Interesting to see what both corners have advised their fighters and what adjustments they make in here. 
I think Carr might have been taken a bit surprised by uh, John Michael Shields, maybe. Absolutely. That that unorthodox style between boxing, kicking. And JMS can do it. He does tie boxing with Carl from uh, SBG. is a good coach. He's been in there with the likes of Damien Darker, so he yeah. has fought high, high-level fighters before. Well, I've sparred JMS about a year, year and a half ago. He is tricky. He is a tricky character. And the scary thing about John Michael Shields is look at the man. He loves this. Yeah. The smile comes across his face. He lives and breathes fighting. Again, hands just a little bit too low from Carl. He started off great in the, uh, at the start round. Get the kicks. There we go again. Kicks into knees. Get in close. Get into the clinch. When you get into that range, score with the elbow. But is this, a, again, is this what John Michael Shields is doing? He's lulling Carl into the type of fight that he wants to fight. Absolutely. Absolutely. He's turned into a bit of a brawl, and when he feels it, he's picking off that one shot he's looking for. Look at that elbow. Looking for the elbow again. Just got hit with a load of sweat, maybe yeah. a little bit of blood. Carl is starting on his back foot here and just covering up. He needs to be careful here. John Michael Shields is looking for a finish potentially here. There's a hand coming over the top soon. There we go. Speaking with John, he said he wants to test himself. I think right now, halfway through the second round here, he wants a win here and to beat one of the best. We see a cut already, that elbow must have scored. Yeah, he cut, cut on the left eye. Wearing a red mask is Carl McCulloch here. Good score, but it might be a little bit too little, too late in the round. Just over a minute to go here. This might feel like a lifetime for Carl. Nice teeth jolting his opponent back. Nice score. And dare I say it, John Michael Shields is turning into the bully in this fight. It could have went that way. Who was going to impose their game first? It seems JMS is imposing his game straight away. Carl looking for that elbow. Jumping in elbow by Shields. Possibly a spin elbow coming up. I can see someone setting up. Oh, over the top. Down elbow. Don't let and the Alec come and fire a back with hands. Needs to garner the respect of Shields here. Shields maybe a little bit too experienced. He's just going to tie him up after he scores. He's not going to turn it into an ego match. He's winning. He doesn't need to take risks. Can he go back to what he was doing great with low kicks? And this might be a referee is, stoppage. Yeah, the blood is flowing from the face of Karl McCulloch. Lands an elbow of his own. McCulloch on the ropes and. I think that's just the blood of Carl that JMS is wearing. And We've seen a spray of blood, movie-like blood spray out of Carl there. Oh, nice cut elbow down. John Michael Shields is like the lead dancer in a beautiful ballet of violence here. Well, one of them elbows has just ruined my lovely white shirt, so someone's getting a dry cleaning bill after this. Tip number one, Mark, when you're commentating on this, when you're sitting this close to the ring, buy a shirt and pennies. <laughs> well, Karl McCallick, you gotta think he's gotta do something big here in this third round. Yeah, it doesn't even take a lot to open that cut back up. A little bit of a friction from the glove or the head will open that back up. And, and again, it's about how the judges perceive and see the match. Causing damage. Nice body shot. Beautiful. Nice. Ripping to the body, JMS. Linking up his shots. <laughs> Blood spraying the ring again. Great low kick. He's going back to that low kick. JMS has really changed up himself very nicely. He's, he's shown a nice toy style today. We thought we, I thought he'd be a little bit more unorthodox, but he actually turns out to have a great A class Muay Thai style. That's better, our Carl. Great kicks. And he seems the type of fighter who's just studied it all and works on every aspect of his fight game. Breathing heavy now, mouth opened. Carl McCallick for him. Unfortunately, looks like something from a horror movie here that Wes Craven would be proud of. Blood flowing from the face of McCallick, but the Marauder keeps pushing forward. Nice shot. Stiff jab, beautiful by JMS. Nice jumping knee again. He's going to press forward now. And he has managed this fight brilliantly. 
as John Michael Shields and McCallick trying to land something of real significance. That's a nice kick back. Then kicks will score. JMS has to be careful not to move when he gets kicked. He's shown that he's been knocked off balance. Oh, nice timing on the overhand elbow, down cutting elbow. I have a feeling he's going to try it again. Just 50 seconds remaining in the third round here. Nice jumping knees going back to that move again. I can For the first time in a fight, I think, John Michael Seals starting to look a little labored, maybe. Or is he just saving the fuel for the final burst? But he's going to tie up some seconds here. Nice elbow, but didn't land clean. No. Good score. Was it enough, though? Is it enough for what's left? Nice kick. Just coming up to the final 10 seconds here in your main event, and it's John Michael Shields still pushing forward. He needs to keep pressing. Get a few more scores in. Knees, kicks. Definitely the bloodiest matchup tonight. The greed in me wants to see more of that. But what a performance, and again, short notice bout. John Michael Shields said, I'll step up. I want to fight the best. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for both these fighters. They finished off the show in style for us. After a very, very close fight, the judges have come to this one. Your winner by split decision, fighting out of the blue corner, John Michael Shields. I'm pleased for your appreciation for Carl McClellan.